Hi friends, how are you? Hopefully you are doing well. Today I want to talk about a free web-based inventory control management system. Yes, this is free system and you can use it online and also offline on your local system or laptop. You can use this system on mobile, Android phone or iPhone, tablets, whatever you want. If you are running any kind of business which includes, which deals with sale and purchase, then this system is definitely for you. In this particular video, I will guide you how to use this system. And in next video, I will demonstrate how to download and configure the system offline on your local desktop computer or laptop. And after that, I will make another video in which I will guide you how to configure this system online. And there's no activation charges, no monthly fees. This is completely free. So the window you are currently viewing is a dashboard window. This is showing the complete summary of your business. So without uh, wasting further time, we dive into the system and start using it. Most of the time you will see this window. First of all, you have to type the customer name. I have entered a uh, customer, one customer for the tutorial so i choose this one and one product i already added just to show you so click on pay and here the receipt come so you can print this invoice also print button and click on the print button and you will print this invoice on the computer from the printer so cancel it and click on the back button and sale order window is ready for another invoice and if you want to see the sales history then go to the sales tab and sale history and all the sale orders are here i created this order at 9 9 pm so you can update it also you can see you can add another one if you want to update this one so back button the best thing of uh, the system is that this system keep track of the credits if if you sell something on credit or purchase something on credit very beautifully the system keep track record all these transactions for example i came here to new sale and you type here customer and I want to sell something to this customer on credit and product. Suppose he didn't pay me anything. Zero, 150 in balance. So when I, or we can say he pays something and some not 50. And uh, in balance this is 100 rupees pay. <coughs> in receipt. He is showing uh, previous balance was zero, bill paid 50 and balance is 100. Now it will show in the sales also. You will see bill paid 50 and balance is 100. Next time when you make an order of the same customer, it will show this in his balance. Last time his balance was 100, it is showing here. And when you click on this customer, it will add on the previous balance here. So this is very good thing in this software. Product one, A. And here is the invoice. You can print it. And print, it will be print for, from the printer. Cancel, back, and it is again ready for the sale order. Now we will set up all the system entities, suppliers, customers, production. These three entities are necessary. So first we will go to settings and click on my business info. And what is your business name? You put here tagline, what, what you want to do, what you want to write here. And business address, mobile, this all will print on the bill, on the invoice. Click on new supplier or supplier list. I already added one supplier to show you how it works. 
if you want to add another supplier click on here new supplier and add supplier name address balance if there is some balance on his behalf you can write it here 5000 and create set up customers is a customer new customer name balance you want to add some balance put balance here to create it will create a new customer now go on to the product menu product list to add new product for example here i enter supplier name supply one product name for example Purchase price 20. Purchase price 20 and sale price 25. And a complete pack contains six small packets. Click on create and product has been added. So after adding all your products you will go to the purchases and click on new purchase now we we'll make a purchase order supplier name supplier one no balance product i want biscuits six and i purchased 100 packs order total is 12,000 and I paid only 6,000 to my supplier and 6,000 is balance or I have 5,000 after 5,000 7,000 is balanced save and print and here is the invoice click on the back button and purchase order screen is ready to enter another purchase order so how this system will work I summarize first you will go to settings my business info add your business information here then go to suppliers just keep in mind you will go from bottom to up you will set up things from bottom to top first settings then suppliers and then customers then products and then purchase order all are set up so as I mentioned earlier that you can use this system on your laptop, your smartphone. So how this will look in your mobile phone? Let's check it out. Click on these three dots and go to more tools and developer tools. On the mobile phone, on the smartphone, you will see the software just like this. The menu will go up and sale sale history will see the sale history so this is a view in the next videos when i will describe how to download and install there i will tell you how you will access this system on the mobile phone so here i am just describing you how it will look like when you use it on your mobile phone suppliers supplier list so it is quite user friendly mobile friendly also and last but not the least uh, click on the admin and here you can change your password current its password will be admin admin and now it, you want to change the password you will put old password here which is obviously admin and and put new password here and click on save it will change the password close the window full screen thanks for watching and watch the next video for download and installation